Hello and welcome to David's World. Today we are doing something a little bit different. Since we've all been stuck in our houses, probably some of you's gone completely and utterly mad and out of your head, uh, I haven't been sitting twiddling my thumbs. Really, I... This is far too much fun. Just wait till I'm finished twizzling my thumbs. Okay, let's stop doing that. I, with that I have to be homeschooled with my child, I have had to find other things to do. And I got her a building block type put together and make different things. So I'm going, well, it's a long time. Actually, it's a very long time since I did anything like that. And when I was young, yeah, back in the Boer War, or was it? Or was it the... Hmm, no, nah, well, you know. But I had a McConnell set. I did use it a couple of times, but I never had the patience to physically put anything together and get to something that actually looks like what the picture looked like. So I just made whatever the hell I liked and then got bored with it because it was far too fiddly and I couldn't understand half the instructions. Well, now, now I'm a little older. Let me think about that. Yeah, I think I'm a little older, possibly. So I thought, well, let's go back to this type of thing. So what I did was I bought a one, quite expensive one, because you had a lot of models in it, and one that I got for next to nothing. So here we go. What I do is I got a couple of picture video that I did for the models I made, rotating them and showing you what they look like. And I put those together. Yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> I've gone mad, don't worry about it. So, I have a model here. If it would like to come in and introduce itself. This was the cheap one I got, the cheap set I got. Oh, come on, point in the right direction. It's always an idea, just point in the right direction. And if you just slowly just take no notice that it's coming in from one side. And now it's going to bugger off on the other one. Look there, see? All by itself. There was no help whatsoever from me. So, it's reversing back in now. No help from me at all. Yeah. So, have a, have, a, have a closer look. I made this. It's still not falling to bits, so which is always a good point, you know. But it was a... Are oh, we allowed to swear anymore? But it begins with G and ends in U to put together, because some positions are where the nuts and the bolts have to go are ridiculously stupid to get your hands to. But a closer look for you. If the camera will play along, it would be so nice. And it does work if it feels like it. Come back to me. Yes. So, as I said, it, some bits of it were really difficult because you put on this bit here, which is all one piece going to the handlebars and across to this bit. To put this bit on, you have to put this little nut, which is here, which 
it's there. Let's take it from me. There's a there's a little nut and bolt here, but you have to get the nut right here, and I can't get my finger in and to hold the washing thing to, into place to get so you could. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, so it does work, but it doesn't work very well. And I think it's just because the motor isn't really actually strong enough or my batteries aren't strong enough, but they were new batteries, but it's still, it just, it can work, but it doesn't work very well. But still, it is actually how it is supposed to look. It doesn't steer from the from the gear thing here to, to move the things, but these do move. So that was one of the models. So now I can take that apart. <laughs> the one of the other ones. What I did was they all come in a box, and you have all these parts. Well, actually, let's have a look, because this was my other one, which makes a helicopter. You see that? I haven't yet made the helicopter because it's supposed to be immensely complicated. And I don't know if I have yet the patience or I am not that bored yet to want to work on something which is going to take quite some time because there is a lot of pages to put it together. I made the little car. Made the little car, this little car here. I can't show you it because when I made another model, I had to take the car apart because I needed the parts on the car to make... Yeah. yeah. So my little car couldn't stay together. It was very disappointing. Because it was like... Uh, but... Let's see if I can get to the back page. I think that's where my... Yeah. That's all the parts. And they just come in plastic bags grouped together, you know, like all the nuts in. So I thought, well, we'll. I'm going to spend all day just trying to find the beeping part that I want to make whatever I make. So what I did was I went to Home Bargains. As you do, you know, there's nothing. Yeah. But I went to Home Bargains. And they had these plastic hobby boxes. So. This is the plastic, I should be able to spit a plug for This is where I have put all the parts into the whole box, the whole model box all fit into this one box. And my parts for this one actually fit into another one. So they are separate, but I could put them together, which wouldn't make a whole heap of difference other than I will have a whole pile of nuts and bolts and other parts. But the parts are all, as you hear, locked down. So they're all separate. I had some tiny little bags, so I separated off Boy, that sounds really bad, doesn't it? I sat on the floor and separated off the parts which were small in, and put them into little bags because I had some little bags. I think I got them to put money and like coins and stuff in. But any screws which are that you don't use as often. And I have. Oh. When I take them all apart, I put them all back into their little bags and put it back into the box so next time I can just get to the parts. Of course, some of these parts don't fit in bags, so those are just in one of the dividers, all neatly, all nicely, all apart. And I think that is very good of me to be that organised to do that. So. But if you see my short clip of my other two that I did. But 
that's what's keeping me occupied and on any other time if it wasn't like right now I don't know if I would sit and do this and make anything other than this is actually now model 3 I've made at all because I would be doing something else probably going to the gym what's a gym? Hey. what's going out? the only time I go out is to get shopping I don't even go out for the exercise bit I just go up and downstairs a lot so just to say that if you're getting bored you know get a nice little hobby get something which isn't too expensive and the money for this um, what I got my daughter for her bit all came from money that I would have spent during the two weeks Easter break which is a non-holiday for us this year because we didn't go so the money I had put away for that holiday I put some of the money into buying these sets for her to make models and these ones for me to make models because I don't think she's patient enough to put together all these nuts and bolts so find something to do make something be productive and don't just sit and watch telly all day because some of it is as boring as hell just saying watch all my videos instead always good for a laugh I'm always funny I say with a straight face I am never never not funny I mean I'm never funny no I'm uh, no yeah yeah so please like comment and subscribe hit the little bell for your notifications I will see you very soon on another video hopefully please watch a few more of my videos better than nothing really
Bye for now.